Welcome to the city. I'm in the Instagram one where everybody is did it. I didn't say you should rap now. No, like that's it. Like that's that has to be the jam. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. It's the 8th of July. Lara and the Beat premieres today. The most anticipated movie of 2018. If you knew about Banana Island Ghost, yes, I said it. From the same production house, Biola Alabi Media. They are teach again. They are out with another blockbuster movie with two of the biggest actors in Nollywood right about now. I'm talking Vector the Viper and Sheyishe. It's the first time Sheyishe is going to be in a feature movie in Nigeria, so we're looking forward to what she had, what she's uh, uh, put together for us. We want to see how she she comes around alive as an actor. I'm looking forward to it. The celebrities are sipping in, uh, the, the cast and crew, the actors are coming in. I'm going to be talking to all of them in a bit, so stay with me. How are you doing, sir? I'm doing well, my brother. How's it going for you? Uh, so far, so good. Looking at everybody, they came out here because of you, because of something you did. How does it feel so far? I'm grateful. I mean, I'm grateful to God for it. I believe that, you know, uh, without God, no, this would have been possible. So I'm really grateful to God. I'm thankful to Viola Labi Media coming on board, collaborating with Skylar Pictures to make this day happen. I'm really, really humbled by the turnout. No, I think Giddy Vibes is pretty much uh, was a great song. When we came up, uh, we talked about it and we came up with the idea for it. Uh, we wanted to have the Nigerian or Lagos version of California Love. You know, uh, I'm from California or I'm partially Californian. And um, whenever I hear California Love, you always feel that vibe, that feel in your heart. So we want to do something similar for Lagos also. So Giddy Vibes, we're hoping that was that song. You know, and I hope uh, they like you You guys like it when you guys listen to it. Well, Lara and the Beats is a common of story about the Giwa sisters who pretty much wake up one morning, they lose their fortune. Uh, and they are forced to actually move to this other part of town. So it's a socioeconomic, uh, a film that talks about socioeconomical classism. Yeah. And it also revolves around the music industry because through suffering or through hardships, how deep can you dig, how deep can you dig in order for you to find your true self and pursue yeah. those dreams that you've always held, yeah. been held back for financial security. Yeah. Okay, first of all, uh, we know Biola and Labi Media. Uh, we know what they can do. We know that they have capacity to uh, do very good movies. But essentially, there are two reasons why we supported this movie. First of all, we generally believe that film and movies represent very powerful medium for communication. And we need to talk about positive stories happening in Nigeria. Nigeria is not all about what you read or what you see on CNN and all of that. There are positive things happening in Nigeria and we need to tell a lot about that. And if you see um, this story, Lara and the Bid, you know, to us, it's, it's positive, it's about um, love, it's about yeah. family values, um, it's something also about um, financial, you know, literacy. And you know, we are Fidelity Bank, we keep our word, we are one of Nigeria's um, largest financial, you know, services provider. And then, so we, and then we, we provide banking and financial services to a lot of people, and mostly people who would watch Lara and the bid. So we're excited and delighted to be uh, part of this. The last reason is the fact that we support small and medium enterprises. Uh, Biola Alabi Media is an SME that is growing. We also want to be part of her growth story, like we've done with a number of SMEs across the country. When we did the uh, preview, you know, I heard you know, a couple of the songs and I was completely blown away with you know, the songs. In fact, I had to ask Bella, you know, are these original songs? And she said the songs were, there were nice songs in the movie and they were composed specifically for the movie. Uh, the songs are great and we're already thinking of what we can do, you know, with the, with the songs. You are a part of this. Yes. How does it feel that people came out just because of your work? It, um, the energy is great and it's needed. Yeah. Like, people who are working hard deserve the encouragement that they can get and yeah. this is encouraging it's yeah. very encouraging i appreciate them i thank them so again it's your first time in a movie and then there's shay shay and now there's lara yeah. is there a difference lara shay shay is there a difference yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, or is just lara giwa, lara giwa is like a billionaire and shay shay is like a millionaire so <laughs> it's like a difference you know <laughs> it's all about money so right there's a difference and also lara is very um 
she's kind of spoiled, you know. Um, and I think she needs a few reality checks, if I'm honest with you. And um, Shay Shay lives more in the real world, and um, I'm, I'm a musician, like, a, and, and I, I do I do this. But Lara, you know, Lara's cute. She's sweet. It's just a, a matter of. Um, life experiences you know that happened to her how does it feel that you're one of the reasons why all of these people are here amazing uh exciting not just for me but for the industry most especially because yeah. this is a stepping stone for nigerian movies in in nigeria As a matter of fact in africa so it is a good look uh, i like the support and i think we need more support more yeah. people should come out and support let's do this for africa i mean you know a different role i played uh just expect Obviously, it's a different role I played. So not a DJ. Nah, not a DJ. <laughs> uh, I play a wealthy uh, guy that is dating Lara, and some complications are you know thrown in between yeah. that I probably couldn't handle right. Yeah. Uh, but it was just great, man, to get into character and play someone who is not me. Yeah. I liked it, you know. So you know how sometimes you wake up, you wish you were another person. Mm, yeah, so it was yeah, just great yeah, to be yeah. another person yeah. for for a couple of hours, literally. Yeah. So amazing. I think it's absolutely amazing. As a, as a movie, I think I, I love it. I love the whole idea. I mean, apart from the fact that I love music and anything, yeah. and if you if you do a movie about music, you got me. I think Giddy Life does it actually. I really think yeah. so. Yeah, it kind of covers all the um, adventures of living in Lagos. Yeah, yeah. I mean, from the trailer, she seems like she knows what she's doing, and it totally works. I'm basically just looking forward to a good storyline. Not many surprises, because I think everyone who is on this project, knowing Biola Labi, would definitely have been better to, you know, be able to be on this project. Yeah. It's all about having a good time, enjoying the storyline, and basically supporting our own art. If you wanna get the girls, uh, check it. Welcome to the city. I don't mean the Instagram one where everybody is Diddy. Okay, buy me Lori Titi. Shit, I love that. Koko Toshi Koko Ju Luko Nisha Kodasa. Hardworking man who don't ever, ever stop.